Assalamualaikum. Now it's the last animal category, or maybe I'll make for some other. But this is the arthropods category. Maybe the second biggest, like the second biggest, like it. The whole world, the biggest one is the mammals. Then comes the arthropod. It's in the second one. But if you if you see like an anything, how would you describe it as an arthropod? That's the that's the thing I'm about to tell you. They need to have an exoskeleton, but you don't know how. What is an exoskeleton? An exoskeleton is like a kind of a shell, jointed appendages. Some categories ago, I told you about arachnids, right? I told you what is an appendage, like the, like what is that called? Yeah, the, like the mouth of it. And allow more mobility means it's more active on the land. Segmented body means it has a part. A parted means like what is. What should I tell you? Yeah, I mean it is in parts the body having an open circulatory system means it to like breathe. The circulatory system is like the lung system. Means it you the big circulatory system. Grow by forming new segments means the exoskeleton, which is the shell, it is in parts and it grows as it grows bigger and bigger. The arthropod, the, the shell or the exoskeleton or the segments will keep it's like they will be off, they will take it off and then grow a new one. Take it off, grow a new one. Take it off, grow a new one. This whole process is called molting. One more is there, like the mammals, there are some groups in the arthropods. There are insects, myropods, arachnids, and crustaceans. Insects like a butterfly, a bee, an ant, a dragonfly, and many more. Myropods. What are myropods? Like centipedes and millipedes. Centipedes are like worms with the exoskeleton, but they are more aggressive. Millipedes are the same. But the centipede and the millipede's head are different. The, the millipede is like a curve, but the centipede is like a circle with some two sticks on it. Or should I call it? Like the sticks look like antennas. Arachnids are like spiders, ticks and mites, scorpions. Just watch the arachnid video to learn about arachnids and crustaceans. What are crustaceans? Include slatters. What are slatters? Like the pill bugs or the roly polies that you are, might have seen as a kid. Prawns, like those half shrimp thingy, crabs, and lobsters. These all are crustaceans. But there's one more. This, this is the most important thing about arthropods. They can help us live. You might have, 
how do they help us live if they're just tiny animals and they don't even help us? They, they can pollinate crops. But how do you think this is important? Because pollinating is one of the most important cycles in the world. Like if the pollinating is like if you pollinate a flower, then it will grow fruits and they will also produce seeds by pollinating. So it will create more of the kind and create more fruits. That's how it helps us. But like the insects produce honey. But they also eat parasites. Zing insects and pests I means like annoying like if you for example have a centipede as your pet it can catch flies and eat them to like they're very annoying so they will eat them here is the full meaning of what i'm trying to say there are insects that eat crops so the arthropod use their mouth to eat them so that's why they're helpful because if if we don't have any crops they eat all the crops and then we have no food and then oof so that's why they're important decomposing waste means like there's garbage and other stuff they will eat them and Decompose means recycle them. Being food for berries of birds, fish, and mammals. That's why they help in the life cycle of all these groups. They let them eat. They will let others eat them so they can like have the cycle again and again and again. So these are all the properties of an arthropod. Now I have a few questions for you. So you should answer them in the comments below. What is the first question? Hmm. What are the two myopods that I told you? Answer the question in the comments below. Hmm. Do do arthropods help humans? Answer it in the comments below. And the last question. Do they have means a segmented body or like a separate body? Or Separate body or exoskeleton, whatever you want to say it. Do they have it? Answer it in the comments below. So now I've told you all, everything I know about arthropod. So thank you for learning with me. We've ended the animal category series. So bye bye.